I am Chosen Architect. Alright guys, welcome back. This is Chosen Architect. And today, I have a couple things I want to do. Alright, so first off, um, I went ahead and dug out a nice little area. I want to I move my base, and I want to move it more towards the uh, surface. Um, I'm having a little issue though, for some reason. Just these two stairs keep messing up on me. Don't know why. But I went ahead and made these carpenter stairs, which are made from carpenter blocks, which is literally uh, just a stick, uh, just a block of wood, and then wrapped it in sticks, and you give it that, and then you take those carpenter blocks and you turn them into stairs, just like any other block would. Um, and I have that coming down, and then I'm going to fill this in with a special block that I'm going to show you here in a minute, uh, which is quite nice. Part of uh, tink or part of chisel, which is quite nice. Um, so this is this is going, um, and for some reason, I have is it cutting down trees over here? No kind of weird because I have some of that in there which I shouldn't have any of that at all maybe something's going on here that I don't know about no everything looks fine to me huh that's kind of strange actually I shouldn't have any of that stuff in there I don't know but I do need to chop these down so I can replant them. Nice, just like so. Alright, and that's continuing to work just fine. So I'm going to head back down. I also need to get my glass out of here. Oop, do not need that. Go ahead and get my glass out of there. And my power is running fine. Um, I've got some stuff cooking up. I went mining. Uh, place all that in there. So yeah, so today I need to fill up uh, and gather some animals. So I'm gonna need a neat little thing called a golden lasso. Right here, just like that. Okay, I need to be in here. Okay, so my lasso, just like that, requires just a little bit of stuff, and I have a golden lasso. Now what's neat about the golden lasso is I can find a mob, so let me use my mini map, I'll take, go ahead and go for a cow. So a cow should be right over here, right here. So all I do is do a nice little right click, and then I have a cow, and it says I have a cow. Uh, in the metadata. Oh, I just realized. So before I start messing with this, I can just go ahead and place that anywhere. And hold that for now. I need to make fence gates. Just like that. So I just need some sticks and some wood. I'm going to need a few of them. So... Probably gonna need more than that. So let me get a couple more sticks. Okay, so I'm gonna need six. Just place them there. Oh, Enderman. Whoa, that is placing funny. I wonder if that's what that was. Was it Enderman? Hmm. Unless I really missed it. I don't know why I broke that one. <coughs> it's kind of strange. But anyways, uh, let's finish placing these the right direction. And let's see, do I have another fence in here? Uh, I'll just go ahead and make, make them. Wow, if I can place things right today. 
Okay, so I think I'm gonna want cows in this stall. So all I gotta do is take my lasso with the cow in it, plop it right in there, then I have a cow. Nice. So I need to gather another cow. It says there's one over here, which there is. Pick that fella up. And I even think that you can pick villagers up with this, if I'm not mistaken. So I got my two cows. Nice. Give me a nice source of leather. I'm going to go over and gather some sheep. Just like that. I think it's any mob. I think you can pick up hostile mobs with it as well. I don't know though. I haven't, I haven't really experimented. Uh, where do I want sheep? I can put sheep there. It's no big deal. Let's see if I can pick this guy up. No, I can't. Okay. So I can't pick up zombies for some reason. So you can use a safari net to do stuff like that, though. Gotta watch out for these holes. Went and pick that guy up. And as you can see, it says sheep. And I believe that it also keeps the colors if they're a certain color. And I see a couple of chickens. I'm going to need to gather some of them. Get some food on my hot bar. Okay, place this guy just like so. Nice. So we got our cows, sheep. They're looking mighty fine. I'm also going to need to get some stairs to go up top. Ooh, I'll go ahead and chop this down while I'm over here. Don't want to mess with that great wood tree. That could come in handy later on. Okay, so let's see what else we got. Pigs. Could definitely use some pigs. Quite nice. Go ahead. We're going to need all this. Which use the, the rubber. Turn it into plastic. I think that's what it is. The nice raw rubber seeds and we'll turn them into plastic. We definitely need some more of that. Okay. Then after I get a few more of these. Let's see. Where's another pig? There's got to be a pig over here. Yep, yeah, right here. Perfect. I already see they got two zombies over there. I want to stay away from that. I just I don't want to make them angry. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna get some sleep and then see the stairs I just fixed are turned funny again. Hmm. I wonder what's causing that. I don't know, but I get some sleep. I'll be right back. All right. So I went ahead and got my last chicken. And boom, so now I have pretty much a full-fledged farm set up. Quite nice. Um, now, the only th other thing I might want would be a villager, and I don't know if I can pick them up with this. Oh, my blocks are fixed again. That is so strange how that keeps doing that. I don't know what, I don't know what the deal is. Um, but anyways, let's go back down to the base, and let's get a few things straight. Go ahead and pick up the blocks all right so let's get rid of some of this junk I don't need any more of this I don't know if I'm gonna need the carpet I don't I don't know if I'm gonna need the hammer right now but I'll def I might definitely need it. I never I realized what I did with a chisel uh, you can actually change the blocks without putting it inside of it but it, you have to circulate through them all just kind of a pain and I wouldn't actually want to deal with all that but as you can see say I don't want this uh, cobblestone to be here I I just right click on it but it doesn't actually activate right away 
yeah, it's, it's just weird how it works. Yeah, just like that. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of that. I don't know if this, the carpenter's chisel, does the same thing. No. Yeah. And then it uses up some durability. I'm not a big fan. Okay. So let's pick this guy up. Take some more. I also emptied out my smeltery just so whenever we go to move things, uh, it'll be a lot easier on me. But uh, for some reason, I found it causes a little lag when this goes to pour out into here. Not that big of a deal, but I only needed uh, three pieces. That's all I needed. All right, there we go. Okay, so let's get back up here. Go ahead and get to bat. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this area up. There wasn't much left to finish. Just needed to put some windows in here. And that was about it. It's really nice looking. Uh, I think. I think it's really nice. Perfect looking uh, barn. Nice. All right, now this little base area. Let's let's start working on that. We're gonna need a few things for that. Let's go ahead and get big again. But we're definitely gonna need a few things. So, all right. So I want to do. Ch I want to use chisel. Uh, so let's let's start off with some chisel. Let me turn my phone off again. I thought I had my, I thought I have everything off, but I guess not. Okay, so chisel. Let's do factory, because that's what I want to use. Some factory blocks, right here. So this is what I'm going to need. I'm going to need quite a few of these guys, so I want to keep making them until I get quite a few. That's probably good enough. I don't want to use too much iron, but it does give me quite a bit. Okay, so with the chisel, I have quite a few options right here, as you can see. So I'm definitely going to need some of these. This will be my floor. This will be my walls. So I'm going to need to go ahead and craft some of those. Um, then I think I'm going to use this for my ceiling. Get a couple of those. I like to use these for the corners. And we'll go from there. Alright, so I already have this area pretty much dug out. So, it'll be nice. Um, what ones do I want to use for the stairs? I might actually go with, let's see. Hmm. I'll try these. Yeah, they look quite nice. So all you gotta do is with these carpenter blocks, you can make them look like any block just by clicking on them. Just like that. Perfect. All right, so my floor. I'm gonna go ahead and make these. Just like so. And I already had this already made out. And I just think these blocks look so nice. Especially for a mod pack like we're playing with. Where everything's based off of uh, industry. Okay, so I must have ran out. No, I didn't run out. Okay. It's just didn't replace them with the right block. So with the chisel, of course, I can just go back in and say, hey, I want these to be this. Go ahead and get rid of all that. So what I did, I made a little 9 by 9 for right now. I'm also going to be expanding this for sure. Uh, it'll be branched off into its own little areas. Okay, so something's not right. Okay. 
Now my walls, um, I wanted it to look like this. I kind of like the way this block looks when it's up against a wall like that. Now the upper t upper half, I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to be building to make that look right. Um, let's do this. Okay. So I'll take this guy. Just like so. Alright. These walls, I just think they look... These, these blocks are just quite amazing in, in, their, in their own right, so... Alright. That is not what I wanted. These corners, I like to use, like I said, these blocks. Okay. Getting a little dark so I can go ahead and place me a torch down there. Nice. Perfect. Now you can see what I'm talking about. And I'll just build this up. There it goes again. I'm not replacing it with the right block ID. To get the walls all done. Almost done with this. Okay, this I like to fill with these. I think they just kind of add some flair. Adds that little bit of detail. I'll go ahead and put them in the floor as well. entryways perfect all right now the ceiling like I said I'm going to use these blocks I don't know exactly I believe I'm going to replace this with that same block right here and this is of course going to be like this just want to come down okay yep perfect not a big deal eventually I'm gonna put some lights up top that'll make it look even nicer for right now, I think this is going to look pretty good. Yeah, real nice. Okay, so there it goes again. I'll replace that in a minute. Okay. The texturing on these are quite nice. Perfect. Alright, so now we have a little uh, workstation area. So we come down. Um, nice. Kind of like our nice little underground area. And we'll put some uh, kind of door. Door here, preferably. Probably use some glass. Uh, figure something out. May use a piston system. I don't know. Hmm. I could pretty much do anything I want. I might try some of Tinker's. I don't know. Tinker's has a pretty neat block for doing this. We can look and Tinker's. 
they have uh, something that reacts with redstone. It's called a drawbridge, I'm pretty sure. Drawbridge, right here. Okay, so it takes some um, pretty much gold. Pretty sure gold will work for that. And a blank cast, which is gold in a dispenser. The dispenser requires a bow, so we don't have the string. Hmm. So that may be for another day. Um, but what it does is it, it pretty much, when the redstone's applied and you have a block in there, it'll extend it for however many blocks that you have set. So that might be a good way to close the door up. And then we'll use something to uh, re retract and it'd be nice. It, we'll, we'll figure it out. But uh, for right now, I think we've done pretty darn good with this episode. Um, so all this stuff, I'm probably going to eventually move and move there. I think the hardest thing that's going to be for me to move is going to be this this guy. But uh, I might might slim this down, uh, make it something smaller. I may just get rid of it in general because it's eventually going to become obsolete. It's kind of a beginning, uh, beginning thing because uh, I'll end up using something else. But anyways, um, I got all these awesome tools. Uh, we're going to be moving soon. I think we're, we're having a pretty good journey so far. And if you guys have been enjoying my videos, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I guess I will see you guys in the next video. This is Chosen Architect, and I'll see you guys later.